We are going to paraphrase each phrase of the preamble by defining words in context using a dictionary as necessary and putting each phrase into our own words. This will help us think about the purpose of each phrase within the preamble. So let's look at the first part. We're going to do the first two boxes together. So words of the preamble. But let's think about the preamble in context of today, of all the people in the United States, all the people here living in the present. So we, the people of the United States, that's all of us, okay? So the paraphrase meaning of we, the people of the United States would be everyone, all citizens of the United States. So why do you think it's important that it's we, the people of the United States, instead of some of us of the United States or a few privileged people of the United States? Because it's everyone in the United States. It's all citizens. So the purpose is it names who is represented in the document. Everyone. All of us. We the people. Let's look at the next line or the next part. In order to form a more perfect union. Well, I know right here the word union is confusing to me. I'm not quite sure of the definition of union. So I'm going to look it up in a dictionary. Union. union is a noun. The definition is the action or fact of joining or being joined, especially in a political context. So that means togetherness, unification, uniting, joining. These are all synonyms. So in order to form a more perfect union, we can, we can make that a little bit easier for us. So in order to form a more perfect togetherness, so let's talk about the paraphrase meaning of this one. It's to make everything as perfect in our country as possible in order to make our country as perfect or good as it can be. So in order to make it the best togetherness, the best country imaginable. Why would we want to have the best? Why would we want to have it to be perfect? Well, the purpose is it shares the purpose of the preamble and constitution why it's being created. We need to have these rules in the Constitution. We need to have these guidelines because if we don't have the guidelines, we won't have a perfect union. We'll have perfect chaos, and that's not good. So the purpose is it shares why the preamble within the Constitution and all the guidelines within the Constitution were written. Now let's review what we just covered. This first part acknowledges all of us as citizens of the United States in order to have a perfect country, or as perfect as close to perfect as we can, this is why we have the Constitution. So that's what you're going to do uh, when you're reading the preamble. You're going to break it down and look at each word. And if you don't understand the definitions of words, look them up in the dictionary. Just like justice or tranquility, 